Hello, I'm Lena Taro. In this video, I'll be showing you how to conduct a significance test for slope on the TI-8384 calculator. We'll be using an example that's found in Chapter 12, Section 1 of the Practice of Statistics. To begin, we'll enter our data in List 1 and List 2. Hit Stat, enter on Edit, and I need to clear out what's in List 1. So I'm going to go to the very top and hit Clear. Notice it cleared out the bottom and then hit enter to fully clear it out. In list one, I'm going to be enter the crying counts for infants. It's the number of peaks in the most active 20 seconds of crying. And in list two, I'm going to enter the IQ scores for those corresponding infants. We want to see if infants who cry more easily are more likely to have a higher IQ. Let's enter our data. Now that our data is entered, we're ready to run our linear regression t-test. To do this, hit second mode to get back to the home screen. Then hit stat, go over to test, choose linear regression t-test, and since I know that's at the bottom of my list, I'm going to hit the up arrow to get there more quickly. My x's are stored in list 1, my y's are stored in list 2, that's correct, I don't have to change those. My frequency is 1, and I definitely want this to be greater than zero because I think that more crying is associated with a higher IQ score. That would mean a positive association. And I'm going to store my regression equation in Y1. To get that value there, I hit VARS, went to Y VARS, chose option one function, and chose Y1. Let's go down to calculate to see the results of our significance test. We can see our test statistic value is about 3.07, our p-value is 0 0.002. That means that there's a statistically significant positive linear relationship between crying and IQ. Notice we also have our degrees of freedom. We have our y-intercept, our slope. The value of s describes the spread of the residuals about the regression line. We also have our coefficient of determination and our correlation coefficient. 